What's up guys, uh, this is Dayglow from Water Pond Arms. Um, before we get into the deck video, um, I wanted to make a shout out to Doc and Team, Gl and, uh, Team Blitzkrieg. Um, Doc is a freaking hilarious guy. Uh, great videos, uh, great uh, deck profiles, and uh, you should really go check them out. Um, so anyways, this deck video that we have right now, that I have for you right now, that I'm going to show you is my Unicorny deck. Um, basically when I saw the Thunder Unicorns, um, it's like unicorns shooting lightning from their asses. Like, what more can you ask? So anyways, enough about me rambling on. Let's get into the deck. Um, starting off, monsters is uh, two cyber dragons. I was thinking of running three, but I really don't see the point of running three. I like two because it's a decent, it's good balance in it. Um, let you sync with a, a one-star tuner or a two-star tuner, whatever you want to get out. So it's just there for whatever. Um, two scrap beasts, uh, cause scrap beasts are a beast tuner, and there's not a lot of, uh, support in this deck, so I need to do the best I could. Um, so yeah, they're, they're just for beast tuners. Um, the next monsters are Unihorn Familiars, of uh, freaking useless effects. Just there for, again, beast tuners, um, just help out a lot. Then you have Sangan for search power, obviously. Elephant because it's a uh, it's like a freaking floating elephant head, um, but it, yeah it's a beast tuner too level two, um, so yeah it's just there for helping out. Green baboon um, because of its effect I like how its effect is work is uh, works out and also if I have Sangan set on the field you just tribute him and then you get out green baboon and you beat the shit out of your opponent basically until he plays Sakuretsu or Mirror Force. Uh, Spirit Reaper for stalling, and sometimes I've synchroed with him. Um, I don't really like synchroing with him because he's there to stall. Um, Egotistical Ape, his effect is his effect is good. I actually like his effect uh, enough. I've used them a lot to get out the unicorns, and I was surprised I actually used them at all. Uh, Bicorn uh, Riam, um, Bicorn Riam is a level four beast. His effect is good, I like him, and uh, he has he has decent defense. Uh, Regulus, because Regulus is a light beast, and uh, his effect is barely useless. But, um, you know, when it comes down to it, if he's he's fine for synchroing, and he's cool. Uh, Sunlight Unicorn, um, because it looks like a blue rabbit ash, and uh, it's freaking awesome, and it's a unicorn. So I just thought uh, 2 plus 2 equals 4, so... Uh, honest, I'm actually gonna put two honest in this deck. That's gonna be the 40th card in this. It's only 30 at 39 right now, so honest really freaking helps out. Gale, cause Gale is just super awesome. This cuts the attack down, really good for synchroing, and uh, he's just good. He's just cool. Uh, Key Mouse, cause it's a level one uh, tuner. If I have a level, um, if I have a level four beast type, you synchro with this guy. Um, he gets the job done. And then I have Chain Dog for the last monster spot. Um, Chain Dog is he's a okay effect. I just basically remove him from play to get out an egotistical ape, but he's just there. Uh, spells, obviously, triple book of moon. Um, I kind of feel badass about the uh, about the rare one that I have over here uh, because it's a magic card. Huh. So I feel kind of sick. Um, Double Sarko, because uh, this deck actually doesn't have a big engine, which I really need help with. Um, so Sarko is always there to help out. Double MST, because everyone uses double MST, or they should. Mind Control, Staple Spell. Uh, Giant Trunade, because it's good. Swords, for stalling. And Swords actually works out well with Giant Trunade. It's on its last uh, last sword. You just play Trunade, pop it back to your hand, play it down, more stall, but you knew that. Uh, Monster Reborn, if you have any questions, you're a dumbass. Um, so yeah, on to traps. Uh, Mirror Force, again, awesome trap. Sakuretsu, great trap to have. Uh, Super Rush, considering this is a beast deck. I'm only running one. I only really need one. I haven't actually really used this yet, but... I, I hope I get around to doing it. Uh, red screen for stalling. Um, 
basically what it does is every turn you pay a thousand life points and you have to um, it's not like if you don't want to be attacked you can you can just get rid of this card and not pay a thousand life points uh, but you have to pay a thousand life points not to be attacked and you have to get rid of it manually obviously but yeah it's just great for stalling uh, bottomless trap hole because it's great uh, defense draw and a lot of people question me why I have defense draws like why would you question me um, you're losing no battle damage and you freaking draw one card so it's it's great uh, destruction jammer because it's like magic jammer trap jammer and divine wrath all in one so it really helps out uh, dimensional prison because it's awesome uh, torrential because you just have to have it even with uh, dark hole there it's like you just have to have it Dark bribe. Um, I know it's kind of a it's kind of a downer because it lets your opponent draw, but you know if if it comes down to it, if someone activates torrential and I don't want them to, just play this guy and this, this card and just gets rid of it. On to synchros. Um, I have two thunder unicorn um, because I, I was gonna run three, but I am gonna run three, but for now I only have two. I want to get an ulti. Uh, one just a match, but he's he's great. Um, he's probably the one that I rarely get out actually just the most surprising um, I have three Voltec Bicorn and I use the Voltec Bicorn uh, Most of the time the only down part to Voltec Bicorn is he burns the top seven cards of your deck um, I don't really give a shit about the opponent's deck, but I'd rather not have the top seven cards burned. I know a lot of people like it for mill power but I don't. Um, I have one Lightning Tricorn, and I'm probably going to get a second one, because a lot of people who I know who've ran this deck, um, they have a lot of uh, they have a lot of trouble getting this guy out. It's like, I have no trouble getting this guy out, actually. He's the one I get out most, and I'm happy because, uh, you know, he lets me bring one of the uh, either Thunder Unicorn or Voltec Bicorn from my grave to the deck, so he's good. Um, other Synchros... Uh, double Stardust, yeah, let's go for Stardust, I feel, I feel pretty pimp about that, um, just cause Stardust is super, super awesome, and he's great, um, Ancient Fairy Dragon, um, just, just if you, just if you absolutely need to, um, you know, if they have field spells, you just get rid of a field spell, you get a thousand life point boost, I mean, he's good, and then Black Rose, you know, you always need to make Black Rose babies, uh, just to nuke the field, they have some pesky monsters you want to take care of. You just, you just go fooey and he's, they're dead. Uh, so that was the deck video, you guys. Um, if you have, if if you want to help out, I'd appreciate it. you. You do. You can leave it on the comments section uh, below. That would be the way. Yeah. So below, um, please try and help out. Um, I need to run an engine for this, but until then, uh, see you later, guys. Peace off.